was handed. Two times. Yuri, it's Yuri. No, it's not. What's my name? Yuriella. Yuriella. <laughs> he wanted me to say my whole name. It's Yuriella. Alright, we're about to go ahead and get into this merch. <laughs> uh, you can get your merch at bluecollarcares.com. Yes. Shirts, of course. Different types of the logo. Yeah. It's just not one logo, y'all. Yeah, different <coughs> type, different little style. We got long sleeves. One second. And this, and <coughs> this one right here. It's part of blue collar cash. Yeah, it's part of blue collar cash, but it's called media. Yes. This the back. And then the front. And if you can't read it, it says making everyone display incriminating actions. That's media. media. But let's get right on into the show and today. It will we be. have a hot topic actually of today, right now. Oh yes, we do. I forgot. Before before I even get into all this other over here. Bam, 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 bam. It's really a question that it's really a question that she should be asking. But I know. mean, I'm gonna ask, and it was it's it's a question that you're gonna be thinking to yourself like, okay, I'm gonna have to watch my nigga. <laughs> question is, is it gay for a man to have his booty in the air while he's eating you out? Is it considered gay? Or is it gay for them to have their ass in the air while eating so. you out? I think yes. Why you got it perched girl, up? And I know some girls that think yes too, and that's the that's the point. Why? Why you got it perched up? Why? Why? Why you got it arched? Why you got that back arched? What you what you waiting for? Literally. Because that's the I'm waiting. Literally. Like that's what females do for when they ready to get some poke. Literally. <laughs> Like, I don't get it. I don't get it. No, you gotta be laying flat like a sniper. Fact. Trying to tell you, bro. Why well, you goddamn shoot him? Only time that back is getting arched is when you about to be done and you about to come in this hole. I'm about to get up. That's it. And that shouldn't even last long. Longer literally, than two seconds. Literally, right. Literally, because you're getting up. So... Yeah, that was a question. We, we seen that on Facebook. Girl say she broke up with a nigga for some shit like that. Watch your niggas, ladies. Watch your niggas. That's all I'm going to say today. That's all I'm going to say to that. That's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, that's the question of the day. Let us know in the comments how you feel or what you think. Um, subscribe, subscribe, like, Definitely share, subscribe, definitely subscribe, <laughs> hit that subscription button, damn right, um, I was gonna talk about this video, but I don't really, I don't really believe that shit like that. That's too long. I've heard 
personally feel like at this point, I mean, I get certain things happen to, you know, these celebrities and stuff, but I also feel like they're just, you know, coke, coaxing off of other celebrities that then did it. Honestly. Who did I say the other day? I said, man, get, get out of my face with that shit. Cause... Oh, King Von. They were talking about how King Von ain't really dead. Nobody celebrity went to the funeral. You're taking their money. This how regular labels think, according to T Pain. You have to pay that shit back, but that's not it. Like when they're like, oh, so and so got a ten million ten million dollar record deal. You have to give them back ten million dollars. You're not gonna make a cent until everything you do pays them back that ten million dollars. You can do whatever you want and you're not gonna make now people know about that, but here's the thing. Bro, you know that person that you loaned twenty dollars a month ago and now every time that person brings up anything about money, you're like, Yeah, but you owe me twenty dollars though. That's how record labels work. Right. When everybody said, oh, my record label's controlling me, and I can't get out of this deal, and y'all need to let me go, bro, the record label's sitting back like, we're controlling you because we gave you $10 million, and you think you're going, you, wait a minute, you think you're about to do whatever you want to do with our money? <laughs> this is my video. It's pretty good, right? Well, it's a little boring. Can't you do something like this? And then you think you're about to get out of your deal scot-free without paying us back our money? You didn't do anything. Your shit flopped. The $10 million we gave you was for you to make a dope project that wasn't going to flop. You already broke the fucking contract. So now you think we're going to let you go away and just get out of this deal while still owing us yeah, money? Right. No. That's what I'm saying. Like, is it? First of all, so when people saying that record labels are controlling me and record labels are the devil, then it's the Illuminati and boop ka doop ka doo ba doo. We gotta blame it on the devil because something must be wrong with God if these people are controlling the world and say, No, we made a bunch of money. We gave you some of it, but we gave you some of it because you said you was gonna make it back tenfold. You didn't do that, and now you gotta listen to us. Period. Here's what we need you to do to make our money back. It's not about control. It's about making it. They don't give a fuck if you make it or not. They don't give a fuck if you actually did. We need to want your money back. It's literally like that. And I can say that being the owner of a company. It's not about control. You can do it. You can do whatever you want. I don't give a fuck what you do. As long as you know. Do make some money? That's I'm gonna be the first person to That's why I feel like that. That's just Whoa. how it has to happen. Ain't nothing on his finger. Go lay down. Absolutely. But let's keep Sorry, it let's keep it real. Because I'll get used to being spoiled with something and he you just think comes. You gonna be paid before me now? Now, the shit didn't happen. The shit that I gave you millions of dollars for didn't happen. And I lost money. I lost a ton of money. Keep in mind, I still got a business to run. I still got a family. I still got all that. You got free money for some shit that you said was going to happen, and it didn't happen. Now, you think you about to just do whatever you want, and you think I'm just about to let you go while you still owe me money? No, nah, bro. Not at all. Not you think all. I'm just about to let you say, uh, hey, bro, take me to court. I know... I ain't give you gas money for the last time. You can take me to court this time. I'm going to give you double. Nah. No, no, no. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. I'm not giving you more money so you can owe me more money. Right. Give me back the first $20 for gas, and then I'll take you to court again. You ain't paid me back the first time. Why would I, why would I trust you the second time? We're not doing that. It's the same, it's the same thing. I love T-Pain, man. I love um, how he... 
So yeah, basically, man, when you when you when you sign to a record, record label, they thinking like this. I gave you ten million. You go do what I want you to do until you make my ten million back. Period. I'm not finna just keep loaning you money and you just keep spending my money and you ain't doing shit with it to make me my money back. I'm a, I'm gonna put you in position to make my money back. Period. And I'm a, I'm gonna act like the nigga that I let you borrow twenty dollars and when I see you if you talking about having money better yet. I let your ass hold two hundred dollars, and if I see you and you talking about how you just bought some new shoes, bitch, and you ain't paid me, that's how the le- record label feel, bitch. You ain't paid me, and you over here buying what? Right. You just bought your mama a what? Right. I don't give a fuck about your mama, nigga. I want my money. Right. That's how they really thinking. They really don't give a fuck about your ass. They just want their money. So when you sign that deal, just know it's about that money. Ten million. Yeah, it sound good. Yeah. Really five though, cause of taxes. Mm. Huh. But you still gotta pay them ten, ain't that crazy? Huh. So now you in debt. You got fifteen million in the hole. Already. Cause you about to blow five. Fast. Real fast. Cause you're stupid. But anyways. That's it for today. I'm about to tell y'all what to do. Real quick though. Yeah. Go to bluecollarcash.com. Do that. Get your merch. We got the media merch. Making everyone display incriminating actions. That's a long sleeve. Back. That's the back. And this is the front. Right. With the little logo right there at the bottom, of Blue course. Okay. It's a little wrinkle. Then we got the no t-shirt. Man. The t-shirt. And remember you can find all this on bluecollarcash.com. And with the t-shirt, there is actually two different types. There is two different fonts on the t-shirt. So But yeah. You're not it's not on state. They're on there. It's twice. It's two different fonts. Yep. And we'll be right back. With another one, another one, another one.